All right, it's time to pack up everyone and head in the car. Just performing some last minute checks on the car. We don't want the car to stall um, on our way because it is quite far away. It's, uh, car is pretty fully loaded. It'll be fun to clean up afterwards. Alright guys, so we've just left home. Uh, it'll probably be an hour, hour and a half drive only because we have to uh, pick up some food along the way. So we're just going to take the Alafa Lava Road there, uh, which crosses the inside of uh, Lilumwenga um, and all the other southern, on the coastal villages such as Mufuali'i and uh, Salimua, the Alva'a, um, Afenga, all those villages. So this is the uh, road that cuts um, inside which is about the 30 minute drive. And this is usually our normal commute every time we travel to up here in the morning when I go to work and the family and stuff. So yeah, some great scenery there for you guys. Hope you guys enjoy it. And yeah, so as you guys can see that we're just traveling along that road heading into Tuanai Mato now. Um, so this is the Tuanai Mato area. As you see, we're just pulling into there. Um, so this was heavily um, constructed back in 2012 towards 2014, um, when we started uh, hosting big conferences here in Samoa. That's the NEOC headquarters, the National Emergency and Operation Center. And then uh, coming down here towards where the soccer fields are. Um, this is where most of the soccer competitions are held. And uh, yeah, I've got, I think there's about two or maybe three um, fields there that can be used. And then, uh, yeah, just showing you guys that area where we're at currently at the moment. Yep, so that's uh, looked after by the Samo Football Association. And then we're just coming down towards the aquatic center there. So that's our big aquatic center here in Samo. Just need to uh, make a quick stop. Um, at uh, the ATM of course uh, this is coming out of my pocket for today's field trip so yeah <laughs> good times <laughs> Alright, so after getting some cash out of the ATM, we're just going to pull into the Tola 4 gas station there at Lutopa uh, to fuel up the car before we head off uh, to pick up the food and then straight to Biola. Alright, so just after fueling up the car, uh, we're still in the Lotopa area. I'm just driving down this road as it will take us straight to Joji's Pizza. It's one of the LDS wards, uh, churches, but further down, you'll see the LDS temple and that's uh, the LDS compound there. That's RJ McKenzie, one of our favorite stores, only because it sells a lot of US products, um, which are very hard to find in Samoa. And there you see the LDS temple. Um, here in Samoa, that's located at Besenga. 
So we're just in town now, um, where HJ Kyle is, going through the three the three corners there, which will take us straight to Georgie's, and we can pick up our pizza before we head off to Beulah and and uh, pick up some other stuff on the way. So we're just quickly stopping by the grab pizza we ordered yesterday. I'm not sure if it's on focus, but yeah, uh, grabbing pizza here and then we'll head. Um, we also order some chicken and chips. So we're just picking up the chicken and chips from here. Um, this was a favorite place we used to eat chicken and chips back in the days with uh, a couple of my mates, um, which also belongs to my auntie and uncle. So I usually see my cousin comments on the channel. So it's great to support family businesses, but it's because I really love this um, chicken and chips. So it's also um, affordable. So if you guys want to check it out, Check it out here at Tortua Freddy's Mini Mart. Mm. Alright, so just ice left and then we'll hit to be one. So recently there's been a lot of shortage of ice because it was during the festive season so um, there were no ice at the shop so that's why it's better to just come straight to the guys that make the ice. So this is Tara's ice here in uh, Vaivastai. Um, they usually do uh, some of the best ice. Ice is ice but I like their ice. Alright guys, so after picking up the ice, we are now heading on to the coastal road uh, just at Mota, which will take us straight to Biula. So from this point onwards, it'll be about a 19 kilometer drive um, just along the coast, uh, the northeast coast, uh, or north, north to northeast. Anyway, but yeah, it's about a uh, 30, 35 minute drive, but we could probably make it 25 uh, given that it's quite empty on the road at the time. But yeah guys, uh, we're just going to let you guys enjoy the view for a bit along the coastal area and we'll catch up with you guys once we arrive at Biwa.
finally made it to Piula. That was about a 55 kilometer trip from our house in Lepanga. Um, turning left there into the gate. You guys can see that it says Piula Theological College. This is where this is owned by the Methodist Church. And this is where most of, this is like the college where all the pastors and the reverends of the Methodist Church uh, go to training and stuff like take the actual um, degree in theology. So um, this is the entire campus and uh, the cave pool is situated inside here. Um, so you guys could see this where you actually pay um, uh, with I think it's about three dollars. Uh, it's about three dollars for kids and then five dollars for adults and then ten dollars for the car park. Um, that we'll show you guys once we uh, go down so you, you, you can actually park your car on top um, but you can, alternatively you can take the road this cement road here on the right which will take you down to the new car park so a lot of these developments are actually quite new and that's uh, really interesting to see because um, I've actually been to Beulah quite a lot of time it is my favorite um, you know cave what's the I mean the only cave pool I know um, that I'm used to but it is one of my favorite places to go um, here in Samoa so uh, a lot of these develop developments are quite new and uh, most of the developments that we've seen have actually been extensions so there's a lot more houses there and a big car park area um, but back in the day we used to just walk down from the steps but yeah this is a really big improvement on the facilities um, at Beulah so we had a little I think we took up two houses there and uh, the fans really enjoyed it so I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the content <laughs>
guys, so finally finished uh, packing up now. Done for the day. It's about 4.30. Everyone's tired. Uh, too much time in the pool, so yeah. Alright guys, so if you enjoyed today's content, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share our channel guys. I'm gonna head off home now. It's about an hour and a half drive home, so catch you guys on our next episode. Until then, God bless, take care, stay safe. Thank you.